Dear students, we are in JEE Mathematics and we are in the chapter of Hyperbola. Okay, last class we have started this chapter and four questions also have completed. Today we will solve question number five to eight. Okay, let us see what they have given. Question number five. Ask it in 2016 JEE. The eccentricity of hyperbola whose length of lattice rectum is eight. And the length of its conjugate axis is equal to the half of the distance between its foci is. That means we finally have to find eccentricity. Uh, only one value is given, and the second one is estimation is given. Let me write this. You see, shall I say this is hyperbola? Then we are talking about hyperbola. See length of foot transverse axis is this one. Okay, a a two a. Length of transverse axis L T a two a. But they are asking length of conjugate axis. Length of conjugate axis L C a. L C a is this one two b. Okay, from zero to b and minus b total two b. This is zero to a and minus a. This is two a. Okay. That is equal to foci. How they are going to give foci? A E minus A E. A E and A E minus A E. Uh, second one I am writing. Length of conjugate axis two B is equal to half of distance between foci. See A E and A E two A E. Half of. First of all, you cancel this one. That means what we can say? Say B is equal to two B is equal to A E, or B is equal to A E by two. Okay, B is equal to A E by two. Okay. Two B is equal to half of two A E. A E is equal to two to one. We get cancel out. A E will be there. Okay. B is equal to this one. Okay, now come back for this one. <coughs> Sorry. Length of lattice rectum is eight. Shall we write here? Two B square by A is equal to eight. That means see, b square is equal to a t a by two. <coughs> Sorry, b square is equal to four a. B square is equal to four a. See, b square is equal to a square b square by four. Equate both. A square b square by four is equal to four a. Okay. Now, one year you cancel out. If you cancel out, e square is equal to four by e. Then e will be two by root e. Sorry, sixteen. Four into four, sixteen. If at all sixteen, then four by root e. Okay, e is four by root e. I am, we also know one formula. What is that formula? E square is equal to e square plus b square by e square. E square sixteen by e. Then you equate it. Sixteen by e is equal to. Okay, but b square value we are having e square e square by four, right? E square plus e square e square by four. By yes, correct. Why? In form of a, we are bringing okay. a and a. You can tell out sixteen a is equal to four yes square plus yes square yes square by four. Okay. R is sixty four a. Is equal to four y square plus y square y square. 
But e square also you convert into uh, a form. That is equal to 64a is equal to 4a square plus a square into e square is 16 by a. 16a. Okay. So 16a you send this side. 64a minus 16a is equal to 4a square. 16a I have sent this side. See, uh, 14 minus 6 is 8. 5 minus 4 is 4. 48a is equal to 4a square. 1a you cancel out. a is equal to 12. Okay? a is equal to 12. You require See, a is equal to 12 means b you can find. b is equal to so a you can find e not b e is equal to 4 by root 12 that is equal to 4 by c 12 means it shall write 2 root 3 2 by root 3 they are asking SMCT only. We need not find B. Right? Because SMCT, they ask for SMCT to love 2 by root 3. 2 by root 3 will be your right. Okay? Let us go for next question.